Hello, it's Lolly. Welcome back to my channel. So in this video, we're going to be doing this easy beach waves using a flat iron. If you want to know how I do it, please keep on watching. Alright guys, so for this hair tutorial, it's super duper easy and it's fast. You can do it in less than 10 minutes using your flat iron. So before we jump into the video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also click the bell button beside it so you'll get notified whenever I upload a new video. I upload every week and I'm trying to find the best schedule for me and for you guys. And I really love making some hair tutorials so I'll be creating more of these kinds of videos so if you like my content please hit the subscribe button so without further ado let's go to the video all right guys so what I usually do is I divide my hair into three parts so we're going to start first with the lower part so that's under the ear and then I'll tie my hair up so for the lower part we're not going to actually curl it using a flat iron we're just going to do waves so this is how I do it face it up pull Face it down, pull, face it up, pull, face it down, pull. So what you're going to get is something like this. It just adds volume to your hair. Again, up, pull, down, pull, up, pull. It doesn't have to be perfect actually since this part will not be seen. And it's time for the middle part. So this is where the actual curls happen. So first, just take a piece, not too thick and not too thin, and then comb it. And then using your iron, it should be away from your face. So for this side, we're going to twist it going to the left. So what I do, since it's super curly, what I do is I'm going to go back with my iron and then straighten the end, like so. There you go. And then do the same on the next part. So everything on my left side, I do it going to the left. And then run your iron at the end. Twist. It's not actually a full twist. It's more like three fourths. So it just goes like this. It doesn't make a full turn. And then at the back, I just pick a hair. Doesn't really matter because I can't make it perfect since I can't see it. As long as it's on the left side, you twist your iron going to the left. And if it's on the right side, this way. We're going to twist it going to the right. Ta-da! It's actually just a wave. And then go back at the ends. And then twist. And then pull. There you go. And then the ends are actually curly. That's why we need to go back and straighten out the ends. Okay, once that's done, we're now going to the top part. So my part is usually here. And twist and pull. And there's your wave. See that? It's just a wave. And then straighten out the ends. Get another one. Not too thick. And then twist and pull. Oop. And then look at the ends. Straighten it out. There you go. Since this side has more hair, I just get small pieces. Alright guys, so now that I'm done with ironing my hair, I mean curling my hair, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to 
brush it using our fingers. So for today, we're going to be using a DIY sea salt spray since it's already summertime. And if you want to rock this wavy curls and have it throughout the day, you could use it too. So my sea salt spray is just here in my spray bottle. Give it a shake. And then super duper away. There you go, as you can see, it's just a soft wave. If you want to know what the ingredients in making my DIY sea salt spray, just leave it in the comment box below so I can make a separate video on how I do my DIY sea salt spray. So guys, that's it for this video. If you have any suggestions, please leave it also in the comment box below and I'll see you next time. Don't forget, smile! There's always a reason to be happy. Bye! Boom, boom, boom.